Hey there, it's William with Sage Cardano Staking. Wanted to give you an alternate option to the Deadless wallet for holding and staking your ADA. So ADA Lite uses the backend communication of Cardano wallets. Um, it is produced by a very reputable company. And if you wanted to, you can come in here. There's a couple different ways that you can uh, hold a wallet. There's hardware wallet, which is recommended. We'll show that later. <clears throat> But for this quick demonstration, uh, we'll use the mnemonic. And uh, I've already created a wallet with them. And uh, you just need to put in your passcode. It will help log you in. And then once you're in here, if you have money in Deadless and you want to delegate to a stake pool that unfortunately currently in Deadless it doesn't show, you just need to transfer your money from Deadless into Ada Lite. And uh, so this will go through the same as we've previously demonstrated for transacting from one Deadless wallet to another. Um, that process will occur. And over in your Ada Lite pool uh, or wallet, it will eventually show up that your balance has been received. Now, specifically Sage Cardano staking, uh, we updated our meta tags. And unfortunately, that kicked us out of uh, the Deadless because of a meta tag bug that they have. Uh, there will be a patch that will fix that, but in the meantime, the one way you can stake to Sage Stake Pool is through finding our pool ID. Um, I have it listed on our Twitter account, this Sage Pool ID. If you take that and paste that into the Ada Lite for delegation, it will find our stake pool that is appropriately registered with the Cardano project. <clears throat> and then you can delegate your ADA to them. Um, and so we're just waiting for the balance to appear in this wallet. There it is. And now I can go ahead and delegate the full amount to the Sage stake pool. And then we can go ahead and delegate it will give you a quick confirmation screen, confirm transaction, and this is how you can delegate, delegate to Sage until the Deadless wallet pushes the update to fix the current GUI issue. Thank you.